Okay, today is January the 19th, 2016. We're watching the uh, 300 millibar jet stream uh, moving across the uh, Pacific here. We can see that uh, there's a very strong moisture field moving down and uh, skirting the Hawaiian Islands right here. This is the Hawaiian Islands right there. And then we uh, move across and there's a disruption again right over uh, Southern California. But right down here is where I'm focused, right here. Let's go ahead and take a look now at the uh, the water vapor loop for the Northeast Pacific, and we can see uh, what's happening here. We have uh, we've got the Hawaiian Islands right here, but we also have a harp transmitter focused right, right in this area. There's also uh, something happening right here on the core of that hurricane force storm, but right here we've got a uh, an opening right there where the pen tip is, and that is uh, preventing this uh, strong moisture field right here from coming down and uh, moving right over the top of uh, Hawaii, right here. So um, the, the jet stream would otherwise uh, be bringing a lot of moisture right down over these uh, islands, and uh, that's a lot of stormy weather. We've got this storm right here. And so once again, we see how uh, Hawaii is protected. Right here, that feature is a, an opening. That is uh, heat being applied right here to uh, evaporate and block uh, this strong jet stream uh, moisture field right here. So uh, this is very uh, good evidence of uh, further weather manipulation. And uh, meanwhile, we have a very large storm right now moving into the uh, Northern California area right here. That's got a transmitter on it. You can see a lot of heat right there. A dry patch, that's the uh, evidence of the transmitter right there in the water vapor loop. And uh, same story right here. They're trying to weaken the core of this system by applying heat to the core. And uh, we'll keep an eye on all of that. Let's go look at the, uh, the rainbow loop. It's very intense rain moving through the uh, California, central and northern California area. Uh, it is forecast uh, later today around 2 p.m. in southern California. We're supposed to have rain. Uh, uh, but uh, I think uh, most of that's going to be chemtrailed. We'll have a lot of uh, aerosol spraying in the skies once again today. We may get some rain. But we can see what's happening here. If we go to the, uh, the rainbow loop, there's not a whole lot uh, going on right here in, in the southern portion of California. LA is right there. And we may get a just a little sprinkling. Uh, they were calling for maybe uh, up to a quarter of an inch of rain. That would be great. But uh, we'll just have to watch and see what, what uh, buttons they push and, and, and see what happens. But right here we can see that a lot of the uh, moisture is evaporating right, right in this area. This is a very strong uh, moisture-laden field. It's uh, got a lot of red in it, a lot of uh, light red mixed in with the yellow. So that, that's heavy rain. And that should be moving right on through <clears throat> un, unimpeded, but uh, we see what's happening right here. So, all right, let's go ahead and look at the, uh, of course, on the jet stream. If you look, look at that again, we can see the, uh, that obstruction, that high pressure is causing this uh, this uh, disruption here in the uh, jet stream flow into California. All right, uh, let's take a look now at, uh, this is the southwest water vapor loop. This is the southern part of California in Baja. And we see all that moving in. Take a look at the uh, rainbow loop again. And there, there is some patches of rain moving through, a lot of moisture moving through. Uh, but again, they are uh, probably spraying right over the top of us, and that will uh, prevent a lot of the lift necessary for the rain. We'll take a look at the uh, the modus today later on. Uh, there is no uh, photograph uh, available yet. It's too early in the day. Okay, now here is Hawaii, and we see uh, what's going on. Hawaiian Islands right here, and we have a uh, transmitter that is uh, blocking this uh, moisture field that would normally dive down right over Hawaii. And so they've got Hawaii protected. That would indicate that this is a U.S. program. That is, the, the weather modification in the East Pacific is being run by U.S. interests, probably the Air Force. Okay. Now, these waters right near Hawaii are fairly warm, especially uh, down south where these uh, <coughs> thunderstorms were indicated. If you go back to that map, you got some thunderstorms down here. And uh, these waters are right around 79, 80 degrees all through here. 
even warmer as you get down towards the uh, equator. Okay, so that's pretty much the, uh, the report for today. And uh, if anything comes up, if we get any rain, we'll do a second report later on. All right, that's it.